Muska the cat, a beloved resident of the Sad Garage Zoo, had won the hearts of keepers and visitors alike with her charm and adorable face. However, a fateful discovery one day left everyone in a state of confusion and concern. Zookeeper Alice, on her way to work, heard faint mewing coming from a bush. Investigating further, she initially mistook the moving pile for dirt, but upon closer inspection, she found a tiny kitten in distress. Alice, a lifelong animal lover, tucked the shivering kitten under her jacket and rushed her to safety. Little did she know that this was just the beginning of Muska's uncertain journey. The poor baby Muska was in a sorry state when she arrived at the zoo's vet, with icicles hanging from her nose. Miraculously, she survived that first night and the next, defying everyone's expectations. Muska proved herself to be a true survivor, capturing the hearts of those around her. Alice had a hunch that Muska was special from the moment she laid eyes on her, and time would prove her intuition right. As Muska's health improved, her curiosity about her surroundings grew, causing concern among the zoo staff. The fear that she might wander into the wrong enclosure and become prey for a larger animal was ever-present. Despite their best efforts to keep Muska indoors, her curiosity eventually led her outside. What happened next took everyone by surprise. I love that cat with all my heart. When she went missing, I felt like a part of me died," said Alice emotionally. The frantic search for Muska lasted two agonizing days, with no sign of the cat anywhere. For Alice, who had saved Muska's life as a helpless kitten, the thought of losing her was heartbreaking. Muska's return, however, was as unexpected as her disappearance. Cool as a cucumber, she appeared at the door of the keeper's office, pawing to be let in, leaving everyone in shock and awe. Alice couldn't contain her emotions. Tears welled up as she stood at the very spot where her baby had returned. However, what her beloved Muska had been through during her absence would forever alter Alice's perception of her. Muska, once known for her boundless energy and playful antics, had undergone a transformation since her disappearance. Now, she seemed lethargic and sluggish, often choosing to nap rather than engage with the keepers. Alice couldn't help but feel suspicious. What had Muska been up to during her absence? The answers were about to reveal themselves. When Muska disappeared for a second time, Alice didn't panic. She had seen her resourceful cat find her way back before and had faith in her intelligence. However, as heavy rains and storms loomed, Alice's concern grew, especially considering Muska's recent listlessness and signs of illness. She decided to embark on a search for her furry friend. Patrolling the zoo grounds, Alice followed the sound of faint mewing, reminiscent of the first time she had discovered Muska. Peering into a bush, she was astonished by the sight before her. Muska, her dear cat, was surrounded not only by a litter of kittens, but also a group of baby hedgehogs. Against all odds, these young creatures were nursing at Muska's side, despite their prickly spines. It must have been uncomfortable for Muska, but her motherly instincts had taken over. In all her years working with animals, Alice had never witnessed anything quite like this. The question remained, what would become of Muska and her newfound family? Muska's own kittens had lost their mother, but had found solace with her, and she, in turn, had adopted the baby hedgehogs as her own despite their stark differences. I always knew there was something special about her when I found her as a kitten in that bush, smiled Alice. But I had no idea just how extraordinary she would turn out to be.